up YouTube. It's Elliot here from Neanderthal Fitness, www.neanderthalfit.com. Personal trainer, fitness instructor, and YouTube talk at the camera, dude. So, sorry about the crap quality and lighting on today's video. Filming this on my mobile in the walk into work. Um, it's about quarter past six in the a.m. It's dark as shit. But hey, it's a nice walk and it gets the juices flowing. So, got a client this morning, so heading into the gym and wanted to touch base with you guys as I haven't filmed any footage in a little while. Um, you know, it's, it's one of those things where my personality is one that gets, I wouldn't say diluted, but my personality is one definitely where I get new ideas in my mind. Sorry, getting a little bit dark here. I will go under a street light again soon and things will brighten up. But uh, yeah, pay, bear with me on the quality. So um, yeah, I wouldn't say my personality gets diluted, but I easily get led astray. So if I read the newest fitness articles, if I hang out with other fitness individuals, um, then over time I get interested in training their way, in training whatever way, um, you know, they think works best. Um, and as a result, since the channel started, I haven't really been true to my ideals of fitness. So I haven't been true to the, what I would call the Neanderthal fitness way. Um, also apologies for the traffic. I don't know how well this sound quality is going to uh, come across in the video but hopefully it's good enough to put that up this afternoon um so oh my god i've gone into darkness again um but yeah as i said i haven't really been true to the neanderthal fitness way so this is kind of a video just to explain to you guys that that is going to happen okay um summer is like seven months away i guess um depending on when you count the start of summer seven eight months away to uh, June or July and as as a result you know a new person is made in nine months um, my 90 day challenge didn't go so well uh, my bulking hasn't gone so well I don't really want to make excuses for it um, the reason that it didn't go so well was mainly as a result of well, I put it down to being as a result of where I'm living currently, so um, I don't really have that much control over my food intake currently, um, and because of that, I'm obviously not eating, I, I am eating, but I'm not tracking my calories so much, and um, not successfully being able to um, kind of say, you know, I'm eating X amount of protein, X amount of carbs, every day as a result you know it, the bulking is is kind of improbable for some people they could pull it off because some people just get big naturally for someone like me who most people would consider a hard gainer or an ectomorph however you want to put it um that's not really the case so i do struggle with the weight gain um as a result you know when i'm not really in control of my diet i can't really sort that out um so yeah neither of the challenges have gone particularly well so essentially i don't want to put a time frame on it um you, you know you guys you watch these videos because you want tips and information on how to get fit and i think also as something i said when i started the channel is to see someone go from shit to fit because all these fitness channels pop up and you actually have no idea where these guys came from what their roots were how they got as big as they did and you know whether they're taking performance enhancing drugs or not not that that's necessarily a negative as i've said i kind of appreciate fake natties in the community they have their place um but you know for a lot of people it just pays to know where the person you're relying on the information has come from where they've got their information from so goddamn trucks driving past trying to ruin my sound quality so um yeah, so that's, I guess, kind of, yeah, 
I've got sidetracked. So nine months, what, eight months, seven, eight months, and a new person is made in nine. So I get pretty damn close to being a new person in those seven, eight months. And so I want to go back to my roots, um, you know, and do what I believe to be the, the best in health and fitness. And for me personally, that means a lot of au natural training. So um, a lot of body weight stuff, a lot of mobility stuff, the whole holistic approach to training things. So um, I want to work on flexibility and mobility as well as strength, conditioning, cardio, you know, everything all in one. And I think the basis is going to be in body weight because the whole idea of the Neanderthal fitness and making this a movement in the future is that you don't need a gym to be able to get fit. Uh, you know, you, you don't need access to the expensive facilities. A lot of the equipment can be made at home, found in the wild, or in fact, you just don't need any equipment. So I wanted to come at you to tell you the direction the channel is going to be heading in. Um, so yeah, I want to go back to doing that. So I did a brief workout yesterday, did some body weight squats, um, like three sets of 20, did some push-ups, again, three sets of 20, did some dips, some planks, some glute bridges. Um, pretty, pretty short and basic because I spent most of yesterday playing on Red Dead Redemption. Um, and as a result, you know, I didn't really have the wherewithal to do a, a hardcore workout. But today as I'm going to be in the gym, I have access to the pull-up bar. Um, so I'm going to be doing pull-ups, push-ups, squats, or the usual stuff. Um, you know, and I'm just going to try and work out essentially every day and just mix it up. Not exactly CrossFit style, but essentially, yeah, work out every day and, and then just mix up how I'm training. But anyway, video's gone on a little bit on the long side. So, uh, sorry guys, right, that's, uh, that's me out. Gonna carry on on the way to the gym and see you guys in the next video.